Oh my god. What book I should read to qualify NET? Can anyone tell me the most important books to qualify NET? Hi guys. Uh, guys, this is Vineet Pandey and uh, I'm wondering that what are the books to qualify NET which are very very important and uh, then I went for various YouTube channels and various people. There are a lot of, you know, India is blessed with a lot of guides. They keep on guiding you. So, uh, I found like people telling you how I qualified NET with just four or five guidebooks or some basic books. Then many of you, uh, many of them, they have David Ditches. And the worst thing is that even those who have qualified NET in my online classes, they have started guiding people telling about the basic books. Anyway. What I know about my student and my preparation. The moment you start questioning about the most important book that can make you qualify net, are you simply willing to qualify net or to be expert of net where you can go to the exam with the confidence and the very pure feeling that yes, you have studied well, you have really, you know, prepared well. So knowing this fact, when you start studying that what should be the book and how should I start reading those things, what are the most canonical books which must be read and then you start feeling like this. So well that's a funny way, I'm going to tell you something very important that uh, what made Vineet Pandey, what made Vineet Pandey the writer, the reader and the teacher. Friends, these are few of my books which are actually very important. And I'm going to tell you something very important uh, about these books one by one and I'll take the camera from a cameraman so that I can talk about all these books and I can focus here. Plus subscribe the channel so that I can enlighten you with the purest thing, authentic things. Friends, UGC Net English has become a field where everybody wants to earn but they hardly think that what will happen if the student fails in exam, if the student gets failure. So most of the people, in fact, a lot of, you know, people, those who have qualified NET in the sixth or seventh attempt with 45% have started teaching you because they just want to make money. Though they have seen me getting thousands of students, so they have a target like getting 50 students. All I want to say is when you subscribe this, when you watch it, remember friends, your money is very, very precious because that is hard earned money and that hard work, work, hard work is of your father is of your mother. So whenever you go to deposit money for any teacher who is teaching online, whether he or she claims to be my known, like I got to know that somebody is using my name on the YouTube channel to get the student, then another student is telling everyone that my online classes were bad, that's why she has opened her own class. She herself is my result. So all I want to say is that instead of criticizing others, instead of talking about the wrong things, that's not my nature. I want to tell you something which is very honest thing for you. Ask the teacher any college or university experience along with the net qualification. Like somebody if has qualified net for 45%, they cannot teach you for next attempt for 65%, for 70%. If Vineet Pandey has 6 net double JRF, he keeps on studying. If Vineet Pandey has 15 set exam and the 16th set would be Himachal set, 17th set would be Telangana set, then Vineet Pandey keeps on reading. Vineet Pandey's knowledge is not limited to David Deitch's Peter Berry. Now I'll take the camera, I'll tell you all that how you have to prepare and please share the video so that a lot of people can save their money instead of being fooled, they can avoid. Just ask NetGR certificates, it should be mandatory and ask the college or university experience because there are a lot of school teachers who have qualified net this time and have started teaching. Their target is to have only five students. 25,000 for five students is enough. So you are going to be the, you know, scapegoat and I don't want you to be that. Well, I'll take the camera. Thank you. Thank you so much. <clears throat> Guys, Critical History David Deches is the portion second. It's a basic reading. You just have to read it for the basic thing. Now, these books are arranged in a very random order. So I'll be telling you one by one. Most important book is David Deitch's and then Peter Berry. It's the beginning theory by Peter Berry. These are the most important works that you have to have it at any cost. After that, you have to go for another history, which is the Rutley's history of literature, which is going to help you in exam. So focus on this book 
because this is the most important book after that. Now, once you're done with these two history books, we need to have the books of literary theories and literary terms. And that's the book which is going to help you. Now, these are the basic ones. Now, we're going to talk about the other writings. And here we can have a book which is prescribed in Delhi University, the Indian writings in English. So make sure you have it. Now, for literary theories and other details, you have to go for Terry Gilton's After Theory. That's very, very important. I'm actually zooming the camera one by one. So it creates trouble. Terry Gilton After Theory is very, very important. Then you have to understand American novels and you should buy Cambridge Companion to Postmodern American Fiction. 99% people even don't know about the book. After this, a lot of students have no idea that there are a lot of postmodern theories, genre theories. And for, to understand those things, you have to buy this book, Modern Genre Theory. That's very, very important. If you have it, then you should know the cultural history of modern India so that you can understand the diasporic writers and other literature. Guys, after this, you have to go for Theory of African Literature. That's by Shedi Amuta. This is one of the best books that I have ever read. And then we have comparative literature, companion to comparative literature, one of the famous works. Guys, when you prepare for these things, you must remember that these books are not enough in their own context. We must go for advanced level books and advanced level book for English literature will be this one. The Poplavaski's English literature in context. Then culture studies, linguistics, feminist eco-criticism. Just think about that. Have you ever heard people talking about feminist eco-criticism? You will say yes. And if you say yes, it means you are from Central University. What about the students coming from the background of colleges? Then we have Critical Cultural Theory, a book of 4,000 rupees. You have to buy these things. Multiculturalism and Post-Colonial Studies Reader. A lot of questions have been asked here. Then World Literature, Post-Colonialism, Feminism, Post-Feminism, Feminism is Queer and Theory as Assistance. Then my favorite modern literary criticism by Habib. After that, one of the rare, rare, rarest book, English in India. That's by Kapil Kapoor, sir. Then Queer Constellation is important. Translation today, post colonial poetry. So guys, ask your teachers who are going to teach you that have they ever seen these books? Because there are a lot of people, they have just qualified and they're always ready to deceive you all. And the, what they do is they just impress you with some creative things on videos and start troubling you. The best thing as an individual that I feel is that even they are using my audios for lectures. So what you have to do is use your brain, avoid being cheated Buy these books if you can. Otherwise, you can join the online classes that I have. You will get the knowledge here. Friends, just imagine that if your teacher is reading all these little books and has a level to read, read all these books. What will be the standard of the lecture which is delivered to you in online classes? You always wondered that why Vinith Pandey is so much famous. Vinith Pandey is very famous because of these books. Vinith Pandey is famous because of these books. He keeps on reading this. He is someone who loves literature. He is someone who has dedicated himself to learn more and more. I do not look at an individual student. I look at in for look at for perfection. I go for depth. Friends, you also know that that we have studied so much. We have studied in depth. We are going to get the best of it. Remember, if you just prepare for net, you won't get anything. If you prepare for JRF and the best of it, you will get a lot of other things. So simply prepare for this thing. And remember the next time if somebody asks you to pay the money, being impressed or somebody is just net qualified. Remember, there are thousand plus net qualified in Delhi University and even they are not trying to teach net because it's not that easy. So there are people ask their mark sheet question it that why did they qualify only for 46 percent? And if they took the help of the online batches, ask them that what makes them a teacher if they never had any experience of college, university or any teaching experience to upper level. A school teacher can give you the homework but cannot make you a scholar of net GRF until the person has worked hard, labored hard. To be a best teacher of net needs time. Vineet Pandey has spent six years of his life with 12 batches and his own records with successful records of individual students. 
so follow it this is for you all subscribe the channel thank you so much may god bless you contact me on 8587035827 god bless you all